Hey everybody, welcome to The Real Show Barbecue. Today we're doing a collaboration with Andy Cook's Food. And what we decided to do is cook ribs in a non-traditional way. Be sure to check out Andy's channel up here. He's a good guy, funny to watch. He does a lot of different reviews on things as well. So make sure you go and check out what he's gonna do with his ribs. And what I'm gonna do is honey garlic ribs cooked in the air fryer. So let's go ahead and get started on how we're gonna prepare these ribs, guys. Okay, what I've done is these are some spare ribs that I've cut up and I've, of course, removed the membrane on the back of it. And what we're gonna do is dip it in this mixture right here. This is foamy mixture. And for, for time purposes, I wanna, I went ahead and mixed everything up, but if you look in the show more section, it will give you the recipe uh, for this. Basically, there's soy sauce, honey, and the reason why it's foamed up is because there's vinegar and there's baking soda in there. Of course, there's plenty of garlic and so forth in there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take and dip these in the mixture. I'm just gonna do a couple, just kind of lay them out right quick. All right, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna put the ribs in here, stand them up sideways, see if we can get as many in here as we possibly can. I don't want to overcrowd it. So it's going to sit up in here like this. Now let's get them inside the air fryer. All right, we're going to be using the Paula Deen air fryer. I'm going to have it set to 400. And we're going to be cooking this a total of 35 minutes. But what we're going to do is set this to about 17. We're going to kind of time it for about 17 and a half minutes. And flip them over at the halfway point. So we're going to go ahead and get this to about right there. We'll put these in there and basically let it go for 17 and a half minutes. I may do some basting if I see there's not a lot of um, adhere to it since we didn't really marinate these. But we'll check them and see how things go. Okay, we're about halfway through. I decided to turn them over and we're going to do put a little bit more of this sauce that I had reserved. I can tell you the smell is great. You smell that the garlic. I am looking forward to these. Let's baste them real good. And we're going to put them back in there. And for about another 15 to 17 minutes. Here's how the ribs turned out, guys. They look great. Uh, the flavor is awesome. Yeah, so let's give them a try. They're still hot, so I may burn my mouth. You can still see the steam coming off of them. This is a great flavor. It's got that Asian flair to it. It's got that soy sauce and the honey and those seasonings in there. It's got a really, really good flavor. Um, I did not marinate it. I was afraid if I didn't marinate it for a period of time that it wouldn't have a really good flavor to it, but I didn't. Basically just mixed them in the sauce that, we, that you saw, put them in there. And it didn't take exactly, it took about 30 minutes total um, to get these really done um, to where we need them to be. Again, great flavor, easy recipe. Be sure to go check out Andy Cook's food. I'm looking forward to seeing what he does with his ribs as well. This is a really simple recipe, great flavors. Again, I will put in the show more section the recipe and how to prepare these. Guys, thank you so much again for watching, and God bless.